In this video, we will cover the details of configuring an Integrify approval task. An approval task allows a user to review the work done in a request up to that point and then record a decision on how that request should move forward. The approver can also record their comments depending on how the approval is configured. The first step to configuring your approval task is to add appropriate choices. Right-click on the approval task and hover over configuration and choose configure task. Next, click on the add option button and type in an approval choice. The approver will only be able to make choices from this list, and the choice selected can be used in the start rules of the task following the approval. The complete task if selected option applies to situations where there are multiple approvers on the same approval step. Any choice marked approved will cause Integrify to record this value as the definitive choice for this approval task. Other approvers who have been assigned this task but not completed will have their approval task canceled and the process will move to the next task. The Advanced Settings tab for an approval task allows you to fine tune how the approval will behave when used. You can record required, optional, or no comments at all. You can display any forms that have been completed in the request prior to the approval task, and this gives the approver a quick access to information that will help them make a decision. If the approver is likely to be approving from a mobile device, you can allow approval by email to be recorded. This option also requires some additional configuration of the email notification, which I will show later in this video. Next, you can specify a confirmation message to show to a user when their approval decision has been recorded. This previous approvers option allows you to avoid a requesting approval from an approver if, for instance, they have already chosen to reject this particular approval task and they are reassigned because of a loop in the process. Now let's configure the approval notification to allow approval by email. Right-click on the approval task and hover over the configuration menu and choose notification settings. Then use the pre-fill notification with request data menu in the upper right-hand corner. For the source, you're going to choose data, and for the task, you're going to choose the approval task. The fields you want will be labeled as link to and then your approval choices. Click on add to body, and then format the email body to your needs. Once you are done configuring your notification, select Save Notification and close it. The last option to configuring your approval task is to configure the recipients. Right-click on the approval task and hover over Recipients and choose Recipients. You can search for users or narrow down your options by clicking this filter icon here. You can also search based on groups by typing them in here. You can add users or groups by clicking on the plus icon, and you can remove users or groups by pressing the minus icon. If you have multiple users, you can also assign recipient rules by clicking on the configure rules buttons for individual users. When you're done configuring your recipients, click close. Your approval task has now been fully configured. If you have any questions or would like more information, contact your customer success team.